I really just don't see where to go. And why is there a crystal switch? You know, because there was that crystal switch here, but I don't think I've ever, I've seen any crystal switch stuff. Like, what has that changed? I can't get to this right now. The long top lava thing has bombable walls. Yeah, I think I already did that though. Uh, the clover stairs, where do they go? I don't remember. I don't know why I wouldn't have marked them when I came up. We gotta go this way. Back this way, I mean. Let's go up. Let's go here. Those are the clover stairs. Oh yeah, they took me up here. Which I don't think I can get past without the item of the dungeon. That's what it was. So I put the clover there, but I don't know where it's going to come out. Uh, diamond. Diamond was the same thing. I don't know where diamond will come out, but what's this one up here and how did I get there? I've opened, oh no, that's the one that goes outside, right? So I'm just gonna put a treasure chest over it, just like I put the treasure chest over that treasure chest that I don't need, don't need, okay? So in that case, mm, these stairs connect together, right? Like, I think I've already done this one, but I can try it again. I didn't think there was a bombable wall after the one-way door. to go to this one. Push this off, go in here. I don't see any bombable walls up here. Jump over. Go in this one way. Oh, you know what? This does look bombable. Right here. It kind of blended in whenever I first went through, but that's bombable right there. Oh, Nelly. Oh, goodness gracious me. Let's put that up. Actually, let's move that here. Put that here. There. And, god damn it, unlock this. Okay. I don't know if it matters if I'm lighting this up or not. It at least lets me be able to see. Um, come over here. Let's unlock this. And let's hook shot over here. Unlock this, and here are some steps. 
where they become, I don't know. We'll mark them with a triangle. <laughs> oh. Oh, hey, there's something for that switch. Okay. By cow, I mean napkin. Uh. All right, so diamond is there. So we need to go back to the beginning. And we need to walk over to the switch. Right? Kenny Dread subscribe. Thank you so much. Have you played most of the Zeldas and what was your least favorite 3D Zelda? I think I've played all of the Zeldas except for I never finished the uh, CDI games. My least favorite 3D Zelda? That's a really tough one. And I feel bad, but I might go... Twilight Princess? I mean, I, I love all of the Zeldas. I'm a huge fan, so saying my least favorite isn't really super fair. But, uh... Probably Twilight Princess, I guess. Nope, need to go up. And... There. Now, we need to make ourselves go back to the triangle and to do that we have to come through here okay okay let's go up here yeah, I guess I could just always warp again, but it's right here. Okay. All right, I feel good, I feel good. We come right here, we open this. Um, the screen sounds should be on. Uh, you have to go down under uh, on the Twitch page and use the widget to do it. But I'm very certain they're on. They were on last yesterday too. Just people couldn't use them for some reason. I don't 
think I did anything else in this room. Ooh. I should keep this in mind, though. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. Now that we're back. Hook shot again. Go down here. Wait. I will wait and have wing. <laughs> All right. Let me have a wing and then I'll do this. I'm gonna teach you guys how to properly eat one of these kind of wings, all right? You gotta take out the little bone, right? Once you've taken out the little bone and you get your meat off of it, then you can just have this whole thing, just like this. Voila! Don't be trying to bite between the bones, you're sticking your tongue in or whatever. That's how it's done. Ba. in here and this should be the thing we've been looking for which is the magic rod now you can burn things burn it burn it all down okay magic rod Go down here. Go to this warp. Okay, now I can go up here. Which, how do I get there? I forgot how I even got there. Um. Through that, around that, around there, going back through there. Okay, it's kind of the same. Kind of the same path we've been on for a while, it looks like. Over here. Up. Whoop. Whoop. Except this time, we're gonna go up. Around here. Around these fucking things. Over here. Around the boss. We can't get to it yet. Oh, my left joy con is starting to fuck up. Wait, what? What was I doing again? Yeah, up here? No, not up here, right? Am I right? What am I thinking? I got lost again. Hanging around with Rick too much. I 
it's this room down here that I need to go to. I'm fairly certain. Right? I need to go down, left. Yes, yes, yes. Up here. I'm gonna equip the rod. And I can do that. Well, I guess I need to get down. One, two. Woo! Oh my god, please be worth it. Small key! You can open a locked door. Good. Now how do I get to it? <laughs> how do I get there? Um, I know this answer. There are two uh, staircases that I can now burn through. The spade. No, not the spade. The clover and the diamond. That's what I need to do. The clover and the diamond. <laughs> or maybe it's club, I don't know. Of course it's called clover, I know. Uh, which I got to go up there, okay, gotcha. The music seems jumpy, okay. Give me a second and I will restart. Can you guys, uh, is it better? Let me know if the audio is better. Yes, okay. Oh no, these are going away. Right. Ah! Shit. Okay, up here. Yes. Magic rod. Oh, you can go up too, that's cool. Many bosses in this one. Okay. No, I did it wrong. Oh, 
Damn it. just need to know where to go to get there. Yeah, it's probably going to be diamond. I think you're right. Well, if that's the case, let's try out this thing where if you play this song, you go to the beginning. Warp to entrance. What'd you do, Loki? Rank one on the leaderboard. Congratulations. Frickin' Loki, new blind wave leader. smarter. So I need to leave I don't think I know what to do here What's the best way to get through this?
Okay. And then now I just fall. Okay, there we go. Got it. I was tricking myself, I think, a bit there. End up at the nightmare door. <coughs> Crackle Wolf, you're finished. I will never never let you play the instruments of the sirens. Got a fire boy. Hothead! to get him. Do I want to hit him with the magic thing? Yeah, there we go. Container. And that drum is the final instrument, I think. You got the thunder drum. Oh, 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 oh. Thunder. Egg. Egg on the mountain calls. Well, guys, I am about to finish this game. See what the phone has to say. Bring, bring, hello, this is. It is time for you to face the egg on Mount whatever. Be careful, Link. Bye. Click. <clears throat> All right, so. First things first, I am going to use my ocarina to take me back to the village. I am not robbing the shopkeeper. I know how that worked in the original game. I know how it works in this game. But I will go and check out the claw game again. One last time. Before we finish this thing up. Actually, here's Marin. Let's talk to Marin. Thank you for everything, Link. You are the kindest boy I know. One day, I made a w wish to the windfish. What was the wish? It was... no. It's secret. Well, she told us her wish. She wished that she could be a seagull. 
fly far away and sing for people all over the world. <coughs> um, so, if you rob the, the shopkeeper, um, he will, you'll be labeled a thief, your name will be thief for the rest of the, uh, the game, and he will zap you the next time you come in, he'll kill you. So if you're going for the perfect game to get the, the real ending, if you do the thief thing, it doesn't work. Okay, I feel confident with this one. I feel confident. I think we're good. I think we got it. We got our spiny boy. Nope. I believe it is the same in this version, yeah. Alright, let's take the spiny boy to where he belongs, which was up here. I will not get the best ending because I have died. I think I died in my first stream. I don't think I died the second or this one. But uh, I do know what the... Uh, the secret ending is. Like I said, I've played this game before, so when we get to that point, I can explain it, but we will not, we will not be able to see it this run. Alright, uh, anything else we want to get to before we head to the egg? Um, let's see. Uh, memories. We ended up with 22 pieces of heart and 30 exactly secret seashells. So, what that means for me is we're going to use this uh, teleportation, go over to the seashell mansion. Kill a pig. And I think, since we have 30, we get something special. <clears throat> and we get... Ah, oh, shit. A chamber stone. I didn't want chamber stone, I wanted the sword. Maybe it's at 40 seashells. Ah, okay. Um, the sword is just double damage, and because I'm wearing the red tunic, which is also double, da double damage, I do a lot of damage. Okay. We're gonna head to Manbo's Pond. There are 50 seashells in all, so I would have to find... 20 more. I think there's like 30 or 35 pieces. Oop, that's the wrong button. God damn it. I think there's 30 or 35 uh, pieces of heart that you can get. I'm not sure though. I need to select this. I'm not going to be able to find all of them. But I'm happy with finding 30. That that feels right. Um that's nope, my wrong one. 32 pieces of heart. <coughs> okay. We're going up to the windfish, everybody. Mount Tamaranch. And it is time to sing Marin's song.
It is kind of a sad game, because we've come to learn about a lot of characters on the island, and we now know that the island is just a dream that the Windfish uh, created. And for us to escape, we have to wake it up, but if we wake it up, everybody on the island ceases to exist. And there we go. That's our opening. Time has come, the windfish awaits. Enter the egg, hoot hoot. Okay, we're in the windfish's egg. Now, if you guys remember from a little while ago, A second. Yeah, if you guys remember from last Saturday, I looked in the book and I took a picture of the directions that were written in the book uh, at the library. So I need to get that picture and follow my directions. Okay. I don't know. You fall. Hmm. Okay, yep. Yeah. So my first direction is left. Up. Up again. Right, up, right, up, and finally up. And now we're in, I don't know what part of the seg we're in, but we jump. We were born of nightmares. To take over this world, we made the windfish sleep endlessly. If the windfish doesn't wake up, this island will never disappear. We would have been the masters of this place, but you had to come here and disrupt our plans. <laughs> you can never defeat us. Let's rumble. <laughs> That's a good word. Time to rumble. Let's rumble. Thank you, Alex. 200 bits. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Um, experiment with... I'm gonna have this and this out. Let's try magic. Yeah. Let's try hook shot. Yeah. Let's try. I don't know. What do you guys think? I mean, powder in the the same, right? Oh, no, powder does work, you're right. I figured the magic rod and the powder would do the same. You did it! Okay, ooh. So, that look, for all of you who played A Link of the Past, that's a very, very similar look to the wizard in the first half of that game. You gotta remember, this is the link. Uh, the blue ones can't reflect. This is the link from the Link of the Past, so these nightmares that are ruining the windfish's uh, slumber, 
They're literally going into Link's nightmares now. Which are very, it's very scary. Ah! See, the red I can turn back, the blue I cannot. Now, we know how to defeat this one. This is the first boss of the game. It's faster. It's way faster. Just way faster! Uh, you can't scare me. Okay. If he chooses to be Ganondorf, or Ganon, that's pretty scary. <laughs> okay, I don't know what to do. I think I need to dodge the fire piece. And then dodge this. Huh, I don't know. Yeah, he is getting right now. Maybe a bow and arrow? I don't think I can... I didn't see how low I was getting. But I had the secret magic powder. Uh, the secret medicine, Crazy Tracy. What's her name? Something? Woo! Spin attack. Spin attack always works. Too far away. one of our fairies. Throws at, me, throws at me, I can jump over it. Oh, I tried! It was a good idea! Damn it. Okay, I think it'll work, though. I don't like being on the top. Okay, got him again. Yay. Alright, 
I am out of fairies at this point. I don't really know what to do. Spit attack. Spit attack, spit attack, spit attack. When in doubt, spit attack. Zelda villains. This island is going to disappear. Our world is going to disappear. Our world. Our world. Link, you have beaten all the nightmares. Climb the stairs before you. Young lad, I mean Link, the hero, you have defeated the nightmares. You have proven your wisdom, courage, and power. Triforce. As part of the Windfish's spirit, I am the guardian of his dream world. So the owl was the Windfish. But one day the nightmares entered the dream and began wreaking havoc. Then you, Link, came to rescue the island. I have always trusted in your courage. I knew that you could turn back the nightmares. Thank you, Link. My work is done. The windfish will wake soon. Goodbye, Hoot. And there he is. I am the windfish. Long has been my slumber. In my dreams, an egg appeared. It was surrounded by an island with people, animals, an entire world. But verily, it can be the nature of dreams to end. When I dost awake, Koholint will be gone. Only the memory of this dreamland will exist in the waking world. Someday, though, may re someday, you. Though may recall that thou, thou? Let me say that again. Someday thou may recall this island. That memory makes the dream world real. Come, Link. Let us awaken together. Play the eight instruments, play the song of awakening. Kids. Those guys I killed so many times. Aww. My girl who never got to say what her feelings really were.
<sighs> Sad. Thank you, Clankzilla. Ooh, some new animation. I haven't seen this. Remember during the storm in the first animation, Link ties himself to the mast. So, he's been sleeping the entire time, but it's really hard to forget Marin. was uh, Link's Awakening. So, for those of you that are it's like, oh, so it's about Link awakening up on a beach and being on a mysterious island. Well, yes, but no. This Link was dreaming with the windfish the entire time. And that is his awakening. So, pretty damn good little story, especially for a Game Boy game. A bunch of guys just kind of started making after hours, and then the head honchos at Nintendo were like, hey, yeah, do this on the Game Boy if you want to do it. Go for it. So... Um, I did not uh, get to get the secret ending because I did die. If you play the entire game without actually dying, uh, the end does have a little bit of Marin as a seagull going off into the world, which was her wish uh, when she sang in front of the windfish. She wanted to turn into a seagull and uh, leave the island. But she couldn't leave the island. Nobody could leave the island because the island wasn't real. It was a dream. But if you play the game without dying, you get to see that the windfish grant her wish too. So, very nice. So anyway, that was the game. I thought it was great. What do you guys think? Let me know. Uh, I mean, as a remake, it's awesome. This new art style, when everything is like miniature toys... It's beautiful. Game handles great. It plays like a modern throwback, which I don't know if that makes any sense, but the music's great. I, I especially love the Animal Village music. Um, yeah. So, does, uh, do I keep all the items that he wanted to call game? Probably. <laughs> I think I can even go in after the credits and play the game more if I really want to. But, uh, yeah, I mean, this is a, a game that not a lot of people jumped onto. Even, you know, bigger Zelda fans never really, you know, it's hard to get a hold of this game. So it was really cool that Nintendo brought this to the Switch. I'm really happy. Yeah, remakes of Oracles of, uh, Oracle of Ages and Oracle of Seasons would be awesome. I absolutely love, look it up on YouTube, the Oracle of Ages and Seasons, uh, CG trailers they did, they were really cool. And Grezzo, obviously, is the uh, the company that remade this game. I think it'd be cool if they got their hands on other games, we'll see, maybe like Finish Tab or something. 